Hi friends. What's your big point? <clears throat> Just two days before, I was taking an interview of one student. I was a judge in one, uh, you know, um, some kind kind of competition was there. And I asked this question to that boy, and his answer was like this. He said that, sir, uh, uh, whenever I work, I get so involved in the work that I forget about the time and uh, forget about the food, and afterwards it affects my health. So uh, I said, okay, what do you feel like? What can you find, sir? This is this is a typical Google answer copied from somewhere and pasted here, and. The most important mantra I have told you about interview is be honest, be you. Don't try to impress. One of my student now he is HR now. He was taking up in uh, I think he's working in cognizant. He was he told me one uh, incident where one guy came there trying to be smart. Oh yeah yeah, mm -hmm. some kind of uh, very fancy English, fancy words he was using, and he was trying to show. It's like too smart. I'm too smart. You know what? I have my students working for some of the best companies, and I, I really wonder how these HRs pick the right one. Uh, why I wonder because there are so many there come for the interviews. Trying to show mujhe le lo, mujhe le lo, mujhe different to. But the HR the pick, picks the right one. How? And number one is your past shows who you are. Your past and what? Uh, how it was your performance in your academics, your other activities. See, people will not judge you from your words. People will judge you from your work, from your actions. And going in front of the HR. And giving such answers, no one is going to get impressed. The best way to impress other is not to try and impress. That's the most important thing. Many of my students are working in uh, PSUs. They are working in the big MNCs like ThoughtWorks and Symantec. And I I know the background. And they. Even they don't give the best performance during HR, but because of their past history, because of their um, open-mindedness, they get selected. So never ever give such copied answers about what is your weak point. What I tell is accept what is your weak point and tell what you are doing to overcome that weakness. For example, if your uh, weak point is uh, I'm not a good public speaker. I'm very nervous when I go on the stage. Accept it and tell what you are doing to overcome that. They can say that now I'm practicing more in front of my friends than my class, and I'm taking specialized coaching also to overcome this. My communication in English is not good. Accept it. There's nothing wrong in that. And then tell that I'm working on that. I'm working uh, uh, every day to improve my communication by using audio books and uh, videos and reading and talking to people. Nothing wrong in that. You, you can uh, you can say that uh, uh, sometimes I uh, become lazy and uh, delay the things and don't do it in the right time and then my submission or whatever my work is I I, I just get uh, uh, delayed and I couldn't uh, get up uh, do that work in time but now I'm working on that I have realized my mistakes just tell your real weak points now, when I say tell your real weak points. Uh, uh, and I say that be honest. This doesn't mean that go and uh, tell all your secrets hidden. Everyone has some secrets. Everyone has some uh, weaknesses, which uh, you should not reveal. Everyone has that. But only make sure that those weaknesses should not hinder you, should not um, stop you from performing at the workplace. So, so do not go. And uh, even you should not say that. Suppose you are facing the interview of uh, um, when maths is important. You can't say that maths is my weak point. You can't say that. If it is your weak point, what I say, make it your strong point. But you can't say such, do such answers. Hope 
you got the answer for what's your weakness and how to answer the question okay friends so take care of yourself please give a like give me a thumbs up down there give comments uh, if there is there are some doubts ask me i will try and answer it back so thanks a lot friends and take care goodbye